friends of the reject nation happy new year to you i don't know when this is gonna air but this is our first reaction of the new year we are diving into deep blue sea i have not seen this john i'm ready to have a whale of a time coy you know i walked in here and we were talking about how we haven't seen this and the only thing i know about it john didn't even know about it nope. and that there is a song <gasps> the extent i know about this is there is a lyric deepest bluest my head is like a shark's fin okay what that means i don't yet know but LL Cool out. J said it, and ladies love Cool James, Ooh. so we're going to find out. And speaking of, who's your favorite rapper turned actor, thespian? Leave it in the comments, people. Now, please do like this video so we know that you enjoyed it and that your head is like a shark's fin. Please do comment on this video <laughs> that your head is like a shark's fin. And please do hit that notification bell as well as subscribing so oh. that we may continue to make these videos for you, dear shark finned viewers also if you want to check out this full length watch along from beginning to end feature length with our resting watching faces head on over to patreon where patrons get to experience all of this glory as well as exclusive videos that greg and john do over there and we want to thank the fine folks at prepper for prepping us by making this video preptastically edited they do a great job helping us out over at prepper so much much appreciated without further ado it's time to finally discover what ll's been saying all these years let's deep let's blue let's see oh yes oh foreboding helicopter shot <sighs> So foreboding already. Ooh, almost Zac Efron. <laughs> it's like Zac Efron and Ken Marino. <laughs> <laughs> Ken Efron. Oh, is that shark vision? I hope LL's the shark. Yes. <laughs> he managed the best rapper turn actor. If anybody can do it, he can. That's real. Did you feel something? Yeah, I feel something. <laughs> <laughs> The riz on this man. We're having a party, man. Man, this does look like a way to party. To the 2000s. I often say we're having a party, man, when I have a party. <laughs> That's how you know the party started. Are we having a party? We're, we are. We're having a party, we're man. We're having a party. Stop! Oh, no. Don't feed the shark. Why? Uh, grape blood in the water. I don't know if that works the same. I don't know if that's going to summon much. Shark's going to have a headache. Whoa. Not the teddy and the stereo. No longer a party. <laughs> More wine. <laughs> <laughs> oh. It's going to the deep blue sea. Yeah. I hope the teddy bear becomes the protagonist. <laughs> <laughs> it's Paddington's origin story. Yeah. <laughs> Darkest preserve. <laughs> Good thing they were in their swimsuits. Prepared. Ah! Shark fin. Hey, you gotta have good shark music, too. Got a lot to live up to. True. Bar is high, Jaws. Whoa! Oh, the butt. Right in the butt booty. shot. Oh. oh, the butt got saved. Oh, Harpoon Man! Oh, to Tom Thomas Jane! Thomas Jane's here! Thomas Jane! Didn't know we'd get Tom Jane! Oh, Punisher Ultimate versus vegan. King Shark. Yes! <laughs> His vegan powers have activated. It's milk and eggs, bitch. Oh, I'm so excited. Not today, Nanawe. Blonde Thomas Jane. Yeah, from the opening scene beachy. of The Punisher. <laughs> expectations C low. Thomas C Jane. For chum. Skyrocketing expectations. Oh, always. Dude. Oh, and it's LA based? Excited. I know that Wells Fargo building. Yep, yep. Oh. Oh, she mean business. Focus. Determination. A test shark? What we're attempting to achieve here has is. never been done. We're this close to the reactivation of a human brain cell. 200 million, I've sunk in this company, but when the market mm. opens Monday, I don't like heights, especially falling from them. I don't blame you. I'm sorry, honest. Motherfucker. <laughs> 
after the events of Jurassic Park. <laughs> yeah. Decided to get into the shark business. Not taking any more chances. Yeah. Tell me, Mr. Patrick. Have you ever known anyone with Alzheimer's? No. By the end, all my father could do was ask why my mother wasn't. Mm, she did. And each time I told him she was dead, I had to watch him take that loss like a car wreck. 200,000 men and women develop Alzheimer's each year. What if you could end all that suffering with a single... With a single pill? shark. <laughs> How does the shark relate? Give me till Monday morning, 48 hours. I'll give you results <sighs> and skyrocket your stock price, or I'll help you pack the numbers. Got brass. Gumption. I respect good gumption. And a good Dutch angle. I don't know why they gave him that, that shot. With but his hand on his shoulder and all that is very <laughs> regal. <laughs> That's true. They're not ethical. Very strange. <laughs> like, are you posing for a painting right now? It's <laughs> quite an impressive speech you gave back then. Now they're going to Jurassic Park. <laughs> Perfect. Ela Nublar, here we come. The thing in the Himalayas. Alps. We were just trying to do something together. Having fun. Things so. went bad. But you saved all those people. Not all. No. Trauma. <laughs> Mysterious backstory. Yeah. It also has that like late '90s gritty, like amber pinkish color palette. Yeah, <laughs> just film stock makes me happy. True that. Just seeing a movie shot. Navy built it for World War II submarine loading. Namath bought it. We picked it up. Added aquatic pens. You're dying, I guess. <laughs> Looks like Alcatraz floats. It does look like Alcatraz floats. Big shell, Metal Gear. Look at that handsome blonde Tom Jane. Uh, how many big animals has this guy taken on? <laughs> what do you think, amigo? She's a 12-footer. She's beautiful. She wants to give you a big kiss. I bet. She's got a damn license plate. Now we. Pollution sucks. Drop her belly. That's either a real shark or a very good animatronic. I, yeah, I think it's real. I almost wouldn't be surprised if this was some effects houses like... We did you it. Know, yeah. Well, because after Jaws, it's a challenge. You want to out Jaws Jaws. And you want it to work. And you want it to, you know, Bruce to exist. John is Higgins. Green biologist. Welcome to our island paradise. Where's tattoo? Uh, <laughs> the plane. The plane, boss. The plane. Right. We don't get TV. We don't here. watch movies in Alcatraz. So how much do you know about our facility? Treat me like a tourist. No, I hate tourists, and I've decided I'm going to like you. What an interesting eyeline he is, given that he's like the, the, money. the corporate overlord guy. <laughs> Man, shark. Oh. Oh. Nah. It's gotta fight him. <laughs> yeah, jump in. Nah. He's Chris Pratt, and that's blue. <laughs> They're buds. Yeah, <laughs> ride the shark. Let's go. Best way to travel. <laughs> what a great shot. My man. King Orm saved the day. All right, what state's it from? Louisiana. I'm thinking he's bought in a pet shop Ooh. in Baton Rouge. Ate everything in his fish tank, then he ate the guy that bought him. <laughs> We need to talk. <laughs> Later. Let me just take one last look at you. <laughs> Russell Franklin, president of the board of Chimera Pharmaceuticals. Oh, that's a good name. Chimera always goes well. <laughs> yep. That was incredible. Uh, actually, they don't like the taste of us very much. I mean, how could anyone resist? Look at that bod, man. That's true. High protein, man. They bite you because they think you're a fat little seal or rich soup. Oh, that's what you get for caring about me a minute ago. <laughs> Friendly place. You got full sentences. Usually he just kind of nods. That means he loves you. Word travels fast about why you're here and all. <laughs> He's dressed like people think rich people dress like. <laughs> yes, he is. <laughs> Whoever costume designed this movie is like, what's a rich person? Got the sweater. It's on lock. And a polo jacket? Yeah, why not? Beneath its glassy surface, a world of gliding Bars. That is a very cool POV. Shark shot. Hey, Ben, I'm picking up a nasty little bitch of a squall about 30 miles out. Oh, uh -oh. he's going to be trapped. Yeah. So where are they going? They hate me, too. They're going home. 
We run a skeleton crew on the weekends. Literally. Yeah. <laughs> Foreshadowing. This is Dr. Jim Whitlock, the most brilliant man ever. <laughs> Taking the leak. He's pissing into the wind. How brilliant can he be? You'll see. Actually, he's just marking his territory so the sharks stay out of it. Mm -hmm. They don't go over there now. They used to. What happened, Jedi? You missed with the first shot? Took two hits to even slow it down. What, are you kidding me? Two of these oh, my God. You killed it. I forgot he was an actor Michael once. Michael Rappaport is alive. Look, I already told the doc. I locked the pen like I do every other night. The fish got out some other way. Huh. What are you looking at me like that for? Uh-oh. Who are you going to trust? Me. That's who. <laughs> he only trusts sharks. Because I'm trustworthy. <laughs> Someone wrote that down. That is dialogue. <laughs> he said it. Hey, how high are these fences off the water? Well, given the surface variations and tensile strength. God, short answer, man. English, please. In English, please. Eight feet, give or take a centimeter. <laughs> a centimeter? Does water change as a centimeter? <laughs> yep. I'm sorry. I'm making Aquatica sound like some kind of mental hospital. No, no. Aquatica. Yes. The truth is, it is. But almost everyone here is top of their game. Is this haunted room actually stretching? I do immediately think of House on Haunted Hill vibe. Oh, that's time. Yeah. There are three sub-levels. Sub-level one is living quarters. Two, wet lab and workshops. And three, engineering and airlock wet entry. <laughs> wet entry. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> we are mature enough to oh, handle We, we can handle some wet biology. entry jokes. <laughs> <laughs> go to the wet lab now. <laughs> Oh. oh, floppy! Di oh, zip floppy drive! Zip uh, that drive. was a zip drive. That was like the mega floppy of yore. Yeah, you could save so much. Many images. Yes. Because <laughs> I think a floppy could only hold like three and a half full size bitmaps. I got two words for you, sugar. Zip this. I had car to do with this. Unless you called from the city. Oh my god. You ready by tomorrow night? Scarsguard, baby, Scarsguard. Preliminary trial. Now, Joy, Ooh. you wait your whole life for a single moment. Zydrate comes in a little glass vial. So, what exactly does a shark wrangler do? Pretty much what it sounds like, I guess. Yeah. Hey, an auger mask. Did some wreck diving in one of these off the coast of Spain. <laughs> God, yeah, the sweater, the collar, it's just the glasses. so much <laughs> a rich man would wear this. You, um, like wreck diving? I bet you're really good at it. We're on the water. Old cat and mouse thing. Don't float. Ha. Puns. You're the man, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm the man. <laughs> he means that both ways. Well, a man's always got a file. What's it say? Two years. Eleven worth. Smuggling. How'd you make your money, man? You the first rich guy in history. Squeak it clean. <laughs> Look, I got a workable deal here. I don't make waves. <laughs> I meet the terms of my parole. And I'm not out to change the world like the doc. And I'm not out to wreck it either. I feel like Thomas Jane's the writer, Samuel Jackson's the director. <laughs> and that's how the tone of this movie yes. <laughs> is coming together. <laughs> and the cast director and costume designer are drunk right now. Yep. <laughs> there he is. Let's go. Oh, my God. LL Cake Chef. Beautiful work. You got a oh. big fat butt. Yeah. <laughs> God bless you. In the name of the Father, Amen. You are trying my last nerve. Don't make me drown your feathery ass. <laughs> Give myself a cat. It would only be better if he had an LL Blue Jay. Ah. Or a Scrub Jay. Whatever. Any, Any way, kind of Jay. Some Jay. Oh. Beating time. <laughs> oh. Foreshadowing. I'm so excited there's a chef LL Cool Jay in this movie. I'm going in. You guys hungry? <laughs> Is water wet? Every line he says, I'm just like... He's trustworthy. Michael Rappaport. He's worthy of trust. <laughs> oh. Ooh. They're traveling in herds. Yes. <laughs> oh, oh. oh, no. What are you doing? Oh. Super shark. Shark supremacy. Dr. McAllister, we have a situation up here. Could you please come to surface level? Dr. McAllister, could you come to surface level, please? Yeah. All these people are going to die. That's how it starts. Except for her. She's too pretty to die. And she's trying to do good work for the world. Yeah. 
Ah, that was a great shot, though, with her, like, tiny silhouette. I do like the concept because, like, sharks haven't had to evolve, so they're so perfect. I wonder if there is any brain studies being used with shark brains. Could be. Elon's they're so on perfect. It. Elon's oh, working 100%. on it. He's, got He's microchipped a lot of sharks. <laughs> <laughs> Mayday. No, no. <laughs> flare guns. We worked so hard on the surprise that we even had to fool the audience into thinking that this was some kind of set piece. <laughs> yes. How's life underwater? A lot less complicated than it is on the surface. <laughs> I implied He's that. Such good puns. <laughs> nice work with that new tiger shark today. One day you'll have to tell me how you learned. It was a tiger shark. One day you'll oh take me up a beer. Maybe I will. Well, it's all work for me, Carter. But like you said, one day. They are Chris Pratt and business lady. Using a hormonal enhancer, we increased this female's forebrain to five times its normal size. To harvest more protein. Well. Protein that may reactivate. That will. That will reactivate human brain cells as stored in the forebrain of the shark. I'm just amazed that we've come so far so fast without genetic tests. <laughs> Genetic engineering to increase brain mass is in direct violation of the Harvard Genetics Compact, not to mention chimeral oh, policy. Oh, hey, we're in international waters. <laughs> They're hunting in packs. They'll only eat other sharks. You're reading too much into it. That Gen 1 attacked a 25-foot boat. Am I reading too much into that, too? Is my ADR okay? <laughs> Did you tell Franklin? I'm just a fish caper lady. But bringing in that shark ahead of schedule was a very bad idea. Do you like your job? Sharks don't care about jobs. Are you threatening me, Doc? No, but if we don't pull off that test tomorrow, we're all on the street. Make a nautical pun about that. <laughs> street sharks. See? You did it. You should be in the movie. I'm ready. I have dialogue for <laughs> days, you guys. 90s dialogue. Raise those fences like I asked. Took care of it. That's not a yes. Definitely not a yes. No. <laughs> Within a centimeter. <laughs> oh, storms are brewing. Oh, water's about to rise. Shark's about to escape. Uh-oh. Damn. Heavy artillery, man. I'm gonna go kill that storm. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna punish it. Typhoon meet harpoon. Welcome to my parlor, Mr. Franklin. <laughs> Tony Hawk skate shark shop. <laughs> it's the best level in Tony Hawk Pro Skater <laughs> 1. I see so many places to grind. Yeah. <laughs> Collect the skate. Just check 10 monitors and lagoon monitors. I can't imagine as much visibility below. Carter, you copy? It's about to be the perfect storm. No. Oh. Bingo, Elvis has left the building. Okay, we picked you up, but visibility is near zero. No problem. What do you want from theory alone? Nice, nice way to create a suspenseful hallway. Mm. It's like a slasher movie. This ability is pretty great, actually. I was gonna say that's at least gotta be like seventy-five <laughs> percent. I don't know, eighty, <laughs> zero, maybe more. How loose are we being with the rounding here? We can see you very clearly. Whoa! Whoa! Them Whoa. teeth. Whoa! Well, they've been synchronized like this. They're getting smarter. Tell me I didn't see that. You didn't see that. They recognized that gun. Sharks do not swim backwards. They can't. It reversed. We saw it. Those sharks oh, are all Oh, taking out the cameras. Oh, the sharks no. taking out the cameras. No. Got human brain. Oh. Pretty easy code to remember. <laughs> <laughs> the shark already knows it. Yeah. Carter, do you copy? Negative, over. It's just out there, free ball in the whole ocean. <laughs> the deep. Come on. Blue sea. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> Decoy, very smart. Ooh, yeah. Look at him. Look how cool he is. He's got her. Big, big, big fish. The effects are pretty solid across the board. There's got to be, you know, various CG switching to puppets. There was and a, a like couple that. moments you can see that it wasn't, but overall, I've been impressed. Ah. 
Shark Boy and Lava Girl <laughs> united at last. In God's creation. Mm, oh, not yet. Power. At least he didn't say mine, you know. That's good Sharon. evil scientist of him. Given the credit words yeah. due. Yeah. Gen 2 is online transferring exotics to remote terminals. Vital signs to Terminal 1. I love that Michael Rappaport is science exposition guy. Yeah, man. Hey, he's holding it down for the everyman. He can be an expert, too. Eight feet, give or take a centimeter. <laughs> yep. Heart rate, 50 BPM, okay. within north. Them gills. She's sleeping like a baby. Okay. Now extract your brain jelly. Get all that juicy zydrate. Whoa! Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Get on out of there. Owie. In position. Uh, it's a big needle. I don't like it. I don't like it. Even though it's a prosthetic shark, I don't like any of this. No thanks. No thanks. Oh, they're going to show a close up. Yes, they got to Oh, the sound design. The gushing. Oh, yeah. Extract the brain juice. That grease. Now I'm the smartest. <laughs> oh, he respects her and her work. Introducing two cc's of the protein complex into cultured, inactive brain neurons of an Alzheimer's patient. Oh. Bloop. And what you're looking for here is lightning in a bottle. <laughs> Very easy to identify. Mm. Protein complex is interacting with the neurons. Whoa. You woke it up? The neurons are becoming hyperosmosis. Oh, no. Is that, is that good? I think it's good. Membrane integrity <gasps> is improving. It's getting smarter. Improving is good. Connection. Lightning. Still firing. Five, six. I'll be there. <laughs> oh, sir. For 6.560 seconds, you saw what it's like not to be down. <laughs> Whoever wrote this movie is a hero. She just had the best time. <laughs> oh, no! no! He's the first no! one! He's smoking on! You were asking for oh, it! No! Wow! Get that shark out of there! Yes. Get out of there, Tom Rip Jane. your shackles Clayton. out of the ground! Run. No, don't shoot the shark! She needs he knows it. that gun. Oh, oh. But now Ooh. it's got a taste for human flesh. Yeah. And it's going to bring it back to all its friends. It's going to tell them all about how delicious that guy was. Tower, we need oh. paramedics need back now. Research station Aquatica. We have a medical emergency. Mm. I repeat, research station His shirt looks like DNA. Oh, ah, the needles! The needles in this movie. This is worse than Saw Two. <laughs> <laughs> a shark is gonna snatch you out of the sky, He's man. Guy, a shark's gonna jump or something. Just keep doing what you're doing. Oh, oh! It's not great up here. <laughs> yeah, damn. That looks like a practical set. Looks like a real storm. Could be miniatures or something in part. Maybe, yeah. Ooh. It's all right, Aquaman. You got this. Now, does Skarsgård make it out and he's the only one that survives? Yeah. Or <laughs> what a great irony. Get him out of there. Come on. So close. Ah, uh, but he's the bait. It's going to be like oh, a fishing hook. Oh, yeah. Yeah. He's the worm. Just wiggling on the stream. Oh. This movie has good storm chaos. Yeah. I feel the tension. Damn oh. it. Damn it. Oh, no. Scars guard. Ah. Oh. This would never happen to the Scars Guard of today. No! 
Oh, here we go. <laughs> oh, boy. Into the brain with you. <laughs> Ooh. It might go the other way. It might pull the chopper out. I don't know. Take it a pick tower. We're in the wet lab. You got a visual copy. It's okay. Keep trying, gang. Woo! Wowie. Got it. <laughs> Just hit it a couple <laughs> times. <laughs> wow! Whoa! <laughs> Yo, damn Whoa. it, fun lady! She barely got to fun! Yeah. Oh no! <laughs> so much is happening! The sharks have caused many explosions! Yeah. I love if this, this helicopter explosion took everybody out. Why did we have napalm stored in this tower? <laughs> no. <laughs> what a horrible spot for a fireworks factory. Oh my. What was this building made of? Yeah. <laughs> Was it an oil tanker on the side? You know, they just had a can of gasoline, a drum everywhere on every There's single just dock so and many explosions. <laughs> doorway. Brenda, are you there? This thing is dead. She was in the napalm tower. <laughs> <laughs> We're about to see it. The shark. Tell oh. me what that is. That's a good doctor. Oh, you're right. Whoa, he's still alive! What? He's just he's driving, driving him around! Him. He's driving him around! Oh, he, oh. Threw him. he threw the doctor! Sending a, like a message! Ball. You're marked, we're coming for you! <laughs> Oof. Oh no! Guys, he, be anywhere else guys, but there. The wet lab is about to get a whole lot wetter. Oh. No! Now the sharks are inside the house. God, what a day on set this must have been. <laughs> Good luck pushing that thing closed. Yeah, all that pressure. Tension in this movie is solid. Yeah. Your writer versus director assessment spot on. Because the directing is like, I feel the tension. The it's dialogue like actually, happens. I'm like, okay. Yeah. <laughs> yep, here we are. We got to get topside. Find some help. What? Ooh. There's no other stairway from this level. There's no way up. Get the drill. Oh, no. Oh. No. This water. Don't kill him yet. A couple more minutes to bond with them first. I need to know why his head is like a shark's fin. This. All right, all right, all right. Okay, okay. If this is the <laughs> lesson about the drinking, let's just say I've learned. <laughs> Praise the Lord. We go back past the wet lab to the maintenance ladder. We climb down to level three. We get to the wet entry. We take the sub topside two at a time. We go down wow. and get up. Into their domain. Mm -hmm. No. Trust the bird. That's your canary. The bird. What's the point of having a bird if you don't listen to it? Yeah. Don't just go straight into the mine. Come on. Oh. Wonder who could have predicted that? Yeah. Maybe a bird? <laughs> yeah. That's your first mate. You should have listened. Oh, that's a big bottle, too. This is the Lord saying, no, I want you to drink more. Gotta learn that lesson, LL. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. oh, it's like an Indiana Jones, like, temple trap thing. Yeah. Don't get hit one of those bullet wall things. Bullet jet darts. It's like a ticking bomb every room. It's like, like a fun adventure. Like Yeah. Well, and it is kind of fun that, that you do almost have this slasher quality of like you're looking at the corner and then all of a sudden it's just water. water. But it's still scary. Yeah, the villain of the movie is water as much as it is sharks. Yeah. Excellent. Whoa. Through that the flames. Shark doesn't care about fire. Come on, bird. Oh. You, bird. you didn't name the bird? I love that LL's at his own movie. Like, yeah. he's just like, 
thought you would get him to be a part of the ensemble, but this is cool. <laughs> I swear, of all, of all the actor the rappers turned actors, LL Cool J might be the best one. Will Smith's pretty good. That's different, Cody. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, respect the summertime, Will Smith guy. but that's different. <laughs> hey, Jiggy with it. Change the game. He's the first rapper to win a Grammy. I, he paved fair. the way. That's fair. That's fair. I take it back. You're welcome, Will. I got your back. And these sharks, they aren't just breaking down doors for the sheer joy of an art. They're after us. <laughs> just what the hell did you do to those sharks? Made him wicked smart. Their brains weren't large enough to harvest sufficient amounts of the protein complex. So we violated the Harvard Compact. I made them bigger. Jim and I use gene therapies to increase their brain mass. Larger brain means more protein. As a side effect, the sharks got smarter. <laughs> this is an anti-GMO movie. You stupid bitch. <laughs> I'm a stupid bitch. With this research, we could practically wipe out degenerative brain disease. Think of the generations that will be saved. Exactly. How many sticks of dynamite would you have to set off in your ears before your head? <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. You don't see what we've done here. And what you've done is taken God's oldest killing machine and given it will and desire. What you've done is knock us all the way to the bottom of the goddamn food chain. Dang. People will save. <laughs> Jim, Brenda, us. 50 pounds of napalm from upstairs. <laughs> the extreme close-ups are an intense choice. Eh? He's screwed with the sharks, and now the sharks are screwing with us. Instead of a hammerhead, it's a, it's a screwhead shark. Oh, one of them talks like the raptor in Jurassic Park 3. Alan! Alan! <laughs> Alan! <laughs> I do love that he's just got to act just with himself. He's just him and Bird. Hey, uh, you know, on your way out. He's <laughs> keeping you warm. Oh, no, not fair. You didn't even get to reunite with anyone. He didn't get to read the articles. That's what you get him for. No. Ooh, no, 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 no. 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 Grab a pipe. Jump on a ceiling pipe. Go up, go up. Oh, this will be like the cafeteria scene. In oh, Jurassic yeah, the door's going to swing open. Yeah. Oh, no. The Titan sub is wrecked. No, how do we go down to get up? Going to have to ride a shark. Yep. <laughs> Yeehaw. That axe looks so tiny in his hands. I know. Oh, there he comes. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Gonna ram the bookcase. Get under a box like Metal Gear. I am suddenly craving chicken noodle soup. <laughs> oh, bird! Bird! You betrayed him! No! Eat oh, no. Don't eat bird. Little bird boat. Bring your feathery ass here. <laughs> Whoa, bird! bird. Grab that buoyant mustard bottle. It'll save you. Yes. Ah! Oh, get in the oven. Oh, get in the oven. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh. We could all just dive in and see who makes it to the top. Shark study, you're playing before you did. You're getting aqua dementia. You could go first to lead by example. My best friend, Jen. I thought she was going to say something different. <laughs> Listen. We put these on. They help fight hypothermia. That's a start. We're going to have to swim out of here. Sam Jackson. Ah! Oh, he's got that gravitas. Oh, that is so scary. Yeah, man. That's a good claustrophobic, like, It set really piece. is. Yeah, I don't like... like it. Oh, oh no! Damn it, man. Now it's a Saw movie. <laughs> What's gonna... Light the match. I'm not telling you when he faced the lion. Hey, <laughs> you are. Woo! 
against all odds, please make it through this movie. Come I would on, be so LL excited. Come on, you got this. <laughs> be the final girl, LL. Yes, you've earned it. Victory for a mere moment, at least. Go! It can back up. We oh. learned. Oh, Shazbot. You ain't Blow up that shark. You hate my bird. Ooh, damn. Yes. Damn. Whoa. Blow up that shark. Yes. Shark soup tonight. <laughs> Vibrations are too deep. That was from inside. Rapport has been working out. Yeah. Just for this. <laughs> Stand next to Tom J. I got an okay shape for this. We wouldn't get that close if I were you. What is murky? Might make it? No, we won't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a trustworthy guy. I would know. The average human suits two feet per second. The average oh. shark suits 50 feet per second. Oh. Now, what we have here is your basic maintenance ladder. This leads all the way up to the surface. I love you, Scoggs. I really do. <laughs> but we don't know what kind of shape the surface level is in. We're better off taking our chances with the sharks. Hey, you want to go swim with your little fishes, miss? You go right in. <laughs> miss. I don't work for you anymore, okay? I don't have to take Enough! orders. Oh. You think water's fast? I have had it with these motherfucking sharks. You should see ice. It moves Ooh. like it has a mind. Like it knows it killed the world once. It got a taste from Earth. <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> Who wrote this bottle? When the avalanche came, it took us a week to climb out. We lost hope. Now, I don't know exactly we when we turned on each other. Oh, shit. Seven of us survived the slide, and only five made it out. <sighs> now, we took an oath yeah. that I'm breaking now. Swore that we said it was the snow to kill the other. Whoa. He knows the taste of human flesh. Nature can be lethal, but it doesn't hold a candle. Now you've seen how bad things can get and how quick they can get that way. Well, they can get a whole lot worse. So we're not going to fight anymore. Yes. We're going to find a way to get out of here. This monologue. First, Love this. we're going to seal off this. Oh! Oh! What? No! What? Things got worse. No! Mid wow. monologue. Damn. What? Wow. Okay, he's not. He's, he's not coming back from that. I did not see that happening there. I did not see that coming. Whoa! Jeez, man! Everyone gets a piece. Oh, mid monologue. Wow! Wow! It was such a good speech. <laughs> <laughs> he just admitted to eating the guy, I think, and then he got eight. And then he was going to talk about what he did to that guy's son in the snow, like in you know, Hateful Eight. <laughs> yeah, it was next up. <laughs> What is the precise structural <sighs> failure limit for Aquatica? 3,200 tons. What happens when we get more than 3,200 tons of water in this rig? Explodes or explodes. Floats. The support struts go first. Their tolerance is about seven tons. They're going to crack like toothpicks. Then the walls are going to buckle. They can't handle more than 10 tons of pressure. I want to be here for that, man. <laughs> Hug that toothpick. I still can't believe Samuel Jackson got I'm scooped. I know. Woo! It's not safe on dry land. Oh, whoa, oh, shit. Get through the door. Go, go, go. Close the door. Jeez. God. Oh, oh, my shit. God. Yeah, that looks so painful. The stunt team on this got abused. Yeah. God, everyone must have been just like pruned out 24-7. Oh no. Oh no, Thomas Jane stayed. I mean, He'll come be on. fine. Yeah, I'm not too worried about Thomas stays Jane. behind, he's dead. Yeah, but uh, we're good here. Oh, now the fire they have to contend with. Of course, all the elements. Whoa. Wow. Level one, we can take the stairs out. What a nightmare. This is a great set piece. Just water on one end. Sharks fire, and elements. Just a perpetual explosion at the other. Yeah, like the story is fun. The dialogue mostly doesn't work. But when it does, <laughs> it's exceptional. Like, what an odd mix of parts. Yeah. And the tension's great. The directing and the editing have made it very, like, taut. Shark vision. Yeah. 
Ugh. They know where you are. You. Get the hell out of here. That shark is an asshole. Well, the shark has a point, though. <laughs> the shark has been experimented on. They, they did it to themselves. Sharks break through that door. Water's gonna bring them right to us. A level two's only partially flooded. If I can get that access door open, the water will run off there. Buy some time. Oh my god. You are a brave soul, muchacho. The smart Tom Jane. Man, there, w there was a real Thomas Jane heyday back in the day. Really was. He still ah, pops up and stuff. He's but coming right to him. I think he's about to sacrifice himself. No, he can't. I think the Thomas Jane heyday is about to he end. He can't. Don't force me into a crossroads where I have worried. to decide whether I want Thomas Jane to live or LL Cool J. Because I know I can't have both of them. I don't know where like we're this. at with it. Oh, knife it open. Come on, buddy. A shark is rising. Oh, my goodness. It's going to push him right to the shark. Yeah. Now nah, he's going to ride the shark up the, the shaft. Oh, my Woo. dude. Go. Oh, Jesus. No. Owie. Ow. Oh, that perspective oh. would be so... Ah, oh, now so they're tackling close. him all. I'm sorry. No. I guess the requisite mousy, good-hearted yeah, lady they don't always make it dies. Too long. Yeah. She lasted longer than I expect. Yeah. I don't want to die! Grab my hand! Come on! Oh, come on. God, what a nightmare. Oh, it's so tense. Oh, where is it? Oh! It just handed her to him. Oh, ouch. Oh, what a horrible way to go. That is a mean shark. That shark is pissed that off. That is so malicious. I bet this was pitched as Jurassic Park for sharks. It feels like it. I feel like yeah. Jaws and Jurassic Park were two desk notes. Yeah. Sharks probably flooded that level too. Nah, that's LL. Yeah, you're right, I think. Yeah. My man! Yeah, lasted Sam Jackson. We're on level one. We can take the access stair all the way up to the surface. The stairs are flooded. Trust me, I know. Are you sure? <laughs> Give us a goddamn break, kid! <laughs> Not the move, Rappaport. You know always answers. Sometimes the answer you get isn't the answer you want. Oh, who do I call? Get me God. Save us. Emergency hatch on this level, right? This level has bilge pumps on it for storm runoff. If we could reroute the emergency generators, we could drain one whole stairway. You bilge rat. Who are you gonna trust? That's right, trust me. He's trustworthy! Because I said I was trustworthy uh, earlier. Uh, yeah, I, don't yeah. come back. I didn't think that bad dialogue would come back. Here we are. Not mad at it. It's good dialogue. Yeah, yeah that's true. <laughs> Part of what you said down there, maybe you were right. But everything I've done, I don't think I could have done it without you. Oh, they're in love now. Relativity. What do you mean? Einstein's theory of relativity. Oh. Grab hold of a hot pan, a second can seem like an hour. Put mm -hmm. your hands on a hot woman, an hour can seem like a second. <laughs> yeah. It's the best one for relativity I've ever heard. Ladies that's love how cool Einstein James. explained it. That's why he's the master. Oppenheimer cutscene. I would love if that's what Einstein whispered to him. <laughs> It's not about you at all, Robert Downey. Oh, that's so good. <laughs> Relativity. We got one. There's two sharks left. And there's you in the dock doing a little bathroom love. They got pill for what's wrong with these guys. Now this feels sort of like alien, but underwater. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Oh. It sounds like that spooky remix of uh, <laughs> I Got Five on it. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> a lot of people inspired by the film. Jordan Peele and James Cameron. The biggest movies of today. Can you imagine? Deep Blue Sea. Oh, yeah. Can you imagine Jordan Peele's shark movie? Oh, man. That'd be great. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> it's almost crueler that they didn't eat him. I know. And there's your Jurassic Park uh, oh, yeah. dead hand yeah, moment. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you were coming back for me. 
one of your stupid monitors is blocking the pen. And you want to help me move it? Here. You see, we do everything right together. Right together. Oh, so cool. Look at that shot. Come on, drain that bilge. I totally know what bilge is. Bilge. <laughs> the Get most, that Rappaport out of the water. The most pained casual expression. No! no! Rappaport! No! No! And electrocuted! And he's not getting electrocuted! That's how water works! Yeah. Oh! Owie! Oh, oh it is the Twitch! The Twitch! The Twitch! But they're gonna leave him because he respects them. Yeah, like blue. Yeah, that's right. He's gonna do the hand. All the sharks stop. Yeah. Colin Trevorrow, also big deep blue sea fan. Yep. <laughs> oh. Come on now. Punch him in the nose. Whoa! He helped. They respect Thomas Jane. Yeah. I don't know, why did he take a shot and left? Like, what just... Okay, all right, no reason. Because cinema. Ah, I see. Cinema. Okay, there wasn't a rule I missed. Cinema. Damn it, Scott. <laughs> oh. Oh. Pray together. Who is it? Save this man. I'm done. Brothers never make it out of situations like this. Not ever. <laughs> Oh no, you gotta get your research. You I mean, I do hydrate. see where she's coming from. They would all die for nothing, and you know. It's a fair conflict, you know. If you could cure she's Alzheimer's, the one that would be. It. Yeah, that's true. At this point. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Even that came back. Not bad. And it's literally your treachery staring you right in the face. Right there. Oh, what? that's a real one. I do like that they just played the Jaws music almost, like legally. Yeah. That one's real. Oh, it knew. It brought the model with it. <laughs> nope, 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 no. And yeah, God, the physics of water. So comforting in one stretch and so terrifying in another. Yeah. No. Oh, oh, damn it. Damn it. Oh, you, you totally could have had it. Ugh. I wonder if the people who get that implanted would have shark memories afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know, I was just about to say, like, this movie has done precious little, like, wet t-shirting or anything like that. I was going that. that earlier, and then it's like, we're going to save it for the third yep, act. Yep, yep, <laughs> We're going to save this for our most restrained professional character. It's because she's doing it for science. That's true. And Ripley did it, so yeah, you know if Ripley true. could do it. Then hey, she's it's actually the Ripley outfit almost. Yes. Ooh. In the face, Ooh, hoo, hoo. sharked. <laughs> Is she standing on that to ground her? Like, what's the? Th I don't. I guess why'd so. She, why'd she strip? I guess yeah, it must be rubber or whatever that material is. Must be resistant or uh, a base no, or ground. It's ground. A, yeah. yeah. Now you can get your science. I think it'd still be live. No, they're going to eat that for the next week. LL's still alive to cook. Yeah. <laughs> oh, but yeah. Okay. All your floppy disks and your brain juice are gone. Did you do it? Where's Scoggins? Look, I hate to interrupt this moment of burgeoning intimacy, but can we get the out of here? <laughs> yes, please. Is this the only way? Extra butted. Whole place is sinking. I swear, no way at all. <gasps> I gotta equalize pressure before we blow the airlock. I gotta let the room fill up with water. That's only gonna take a few seconds. You ready? Ooh, yeah. And my staff, they comfort me all the days of my life because I carry a big stick. Days of my life. Come on, let's yes. Amen. Amen. <laughs> They're the perfect trio too. The man of faith, 
the man of nature, and the woman of science. Ah. Holy trinity of sharks. Yeah. Oh. This is a good subversion, I think, too, that Sam Jackson went the way he did. Like, yeah. It does tell you the movie and the sharks, by extension, mean business. <laughs> And then they all drown. I would be so dead. Oh, wow. What a shot. That's good, though. Create the visual chaos. Come on. Get out of the water. No. No, we got so close. Damn it. I was afraid they would do this. I was afraid they would do this to us. You redeemed yourself too soon with the prayer. Ugh. Punch it in the nose. It's so, the surface depth, like. Oh, is he gonna stab me stab with the, it in the eye? Stab it in the eye! Take it out! You can be a double amputee. You can live on. Take it out, LL! <laughs> yeah. That was not LL Cool J. Nope, that's okay. <laughs> Stuntman Cool J. Oh. <laughs> Only <laughs> one leg! Oh. No loss of life, Cool J, today. Yeah! Live, live, Cool J! <laughs> yes, long live. Oh. Oh, please. So much blood. Let please, them live. Christ, get him to the short. Thank you. If he doesn't live, they should all die. It's got to be yeah. a big cautionary helicopter rise up shot of like no survivors. <laughs> Or you keep LL alive. Those fences are titanium underneath, but on top, they're just plain steel. They've been hurting us, using us to flood the facility. Ha! Huh. That's the answer to the riddle. They hate because this Because that's place. what an 8,000 pound Mako thinks about. About freedom. Huh? About the deep blue sea. He said hey, the title! Deep, deep blue sea! We have to kill her. Now that's the first real smart thing you said all day. <laughs> but you're one of them, Thomas Jane. We ought to get about two and a half sticks of dynamite out of these flares. I hey. mean, I'm surprised there's any left. Yeah. Take this end of this cable, hook it up to the positive side of the hope battery, and boom. Mm. This would make an excellent Universal Studios stunt show. It really, like... It does look like they just shot it there and removed the backdrops. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna have to swim to her. Bait. Yeah. We watch the movie Bait. <laughs> and then it'll get like enchanted by the story. Yeah, we can, over. we can take inspiration from, from fellow no! shark films. Oh! The, 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 <laughs> oh my. Susan! Oh no! golly. Did you hit an artery? That must hurt too, because it's like Unless it's fresh water out here. Where are we? Um. <laughs> oh, yeah. Is that... Blood? Is, is that, that... Is that... Blood? Congealing I blood? Thick, oh, my thick God. Blood? I, I could go for a snack. I would like taro corn syrup. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> no! no! The stunt show set has failed, yo! You know, I've had enough today. I'm pretty full. What? You gotta you shoot it without your harpoon. Ah, uh, science lady. Raise the roof. Oh, he knows. He's one of them. He practically did just do the hand thing. Yes. Go, King Orm. Yes! LL <laughs> must save you! Let's go! Uh, yes! Let's go! Shark's about to get head sprung! <laughs> hey, Mama said knock him out. <laughs> Shoot it, please! Shoot it! Oh. Shit. Oh, nice. No! What? It shot through Tom Jane, I think. Oh no. He stuck it. He just stuck ah! through. Ah! 
do it now. You have to. Come on. Go, Thomas J. Go. Whoa. Oh, we are stuck in the fence. Oh, damn. <laughs> Look at that rainbow in there, too. Oh. Oh my. Oh, it's wow. a big boy. Welcome to the chum bucket. Woo! I went to college. Man, I want to know how they made that like big old underwater explodey plume before he got swept away. 45 foot shark. You hit me. <laughs> <laughs> it could have been worse. I could have let him eat your ass. Yeah. 45 foot shark. Do, 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 do. 45 foot shark. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that song, you know. Hey, party boat. Here comes the next shift. We saw that big exploding red wave. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Wow. Take me back to the ghetto. Oh, oh my God. Amen. Hey, man. Oh, it's Rennie Harlan. This is the song. How Three is that? Like people sharks, man. wrote this. Three. One wrote the story, one wrote that monologue, one wrote the dialogue. Yes. Akiva Goldsman. Wow. Ah, oh. <laughs> oh, bleed to death with no arms and short sleeves. Oh, my God. This is legitimately the rap theme to Deep Blue Sea. This is so good. The, he's Will Smith in it right now. He really now. is. He's, he's, I, he must have been inspired by like Wild Wild West. What was that era? Men in Black? Yeah, was this 99 or 90 something? Oh, Met Shark Action Supervisor. There were sharks. You got to have a shark action supervisor. Deepest, bluest man is like a shark's fit. <laughs> what does that what mean? That <laughs> it's the chorus. It's repeated. What does it mean? It means he's tall enough that whenever he goes places, you can see the top of his head over oh, any like bookshelves or any high surfaces. Tall. Yeah. Deepest, bluest. I'm just so happy, right? This is the, this is literally the last thing I would have expected. <laughs> You're getting up in a trailer in 2000-something, and this is just in the speakers. You don't know how good life is. Guys, listen. If you're listening right now on Apple and Spotify, leave five stars. And don't click off this this podcast just yet. Because I want to know your favorite music tie-in to a movie (laughs) as done by an actor in it. Oh my God, that is a it's a very a small list, very but broad playing field, Koi. I uh, I'm curious what your favorite is. Oh my, is there I'm, a cat in the beat? Maybe. God, this song. I'm sorry. <laughs> Usually we just start talking right I'm away, but so this, I'm just so mesmerized <laughs> by this. Leave that five stars, and then once you are done with this podcast, go spin LL Cool J's Shark Fin song like five or six times. Just to treat yourself. Koi. Whew. That's a fresh drip you got there. It's, this. It's it's bright and red. It would do well in this film to lure sharks. It would. And that would be what I'd be bright. doing. You could dance your pecs. As a member of Reject Nation, I'd be yeah. like, sharks, sharks, sharks. Actually, oh, LL. I'm drawn to motion and bright colors. Oh. Join yeah. me, sharks. Yeah. Uh, you, too, can get one of these or one of these. Oh, this is after you've been bitten by the shark. That's true. That's true. You turn or, purple. Well, and the... What's it called? What did he say when his when the bruising was was uh he was trying to keep it down? That's right. So yeah, then, totally, know. totally. We're all in spirit of the film, and you can be too if you go to rejectnationshop.com. We got so many great shirts. Just go no look shark at some of the yet. shirts. There will be someday. We'll find someday. a reason to do a shark tea. Wanna... There's a cat or something in this beat. Yeah, maybe k- sharks make that sound. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. What do sharks sound like? Yeah, what do sharks sound? You know, <laughs> yeah, they they capture whale song, and you got the dolphin, you know, like ah, which they is can not talk how probably it. in the sequel. Is there a deep blue sea too? D- where deep their brains kept sequel. growing? <laughs> Could they call it deeper bluer? Deeper bluer seer. seer. <laughs> Man, what a movie! That was a blast, and I mean, yes, this movie obviously has like its own. I'm, you know, like, I've never heard any, like, really 
detailed description of this. No. Because it's a very straightforward movie for what it's doing. Jurassic uh, Park and Sharks. But yeah. Jurassic the, Shark. Jurassic Shark. Oh, coy. But is that <laughs> Megalodon? Is that the Meg? That is Megalodon. Is that's, that that's the Meg? J- Jason Statham's in that one. Yeah. Okay. Jurassic. They should have fucking called it Jurassic Shark. I know. Those fools. Those fools. You can't copyright the name Jurassic because it's a time period. You it could is. make a Jurassic Shark. It is. You Asylum. Could. Why haven't you made Jurassic Shark? Oh. Hey. Don't, don't, get, don't Guys, give them any Guys, Asylum, um, if you do that, we're going to timestamp this airing and you i just want to cut yeah you go write it i just want some concept cut jurassic shark you can send us 50 dollars out of your 500 dollars. yeah budget. i think that's fair <laughs> yeah we've given you that much oh uh, i mean yeah this is it's funny that this should be a Randy harlan movie I've, i haven't seen all of Randy harlan's movies by any stretch but i do understand the sort of like interesting mystique that like Randy harlan c- can make some like high production fun you know craziness on screen uh, and oftentimes, I mean, you know, he's been behind some some pretty significant bombs that were expensive and, and you know, has often uh, in more recent years. But, you know, like taking on stuff that like clearly might not be like the first. I don't know. I get this. Maybe he loves every movie he makes. But like I get the sense that Rennie Harlan is a guy who could be making different kinds of movies if a couple of his other movies went a different direction. Uh, what's he known for? Uh, he did. Well, Cutthroat Island was like a really big uh, uh you know, high production, semi flop, and whatnot. But let's let's look him up really quick so that I'm not misleading you because he's done like a, I think he did Die Hard two, um, which oh you know, okay that that sounds right actually now that you've said it long I wouldn't kiss, have pulled that night, myself Die Hard oh, two kiss, cliffhanger Deep Blue Sea the Exorcist the beginning oh that's what he's up to uh, I think he did some kind of big old action movie recently um, so yeah like it's a funny I didn't know who directed it but I'm like oh yeah that's that, a totally on brand that makes some sense music right supervisor there. LL Cool J I love that his agent got him yes. a music supervisor title yes oh that's so good and what does that mean then did he just uh, did he oversee just oversee his own song y- yeah. Deepest Bluest Shark Spin the name of the song is called Deepest Bluest Shark Spin and I'm so Many people Happy. wrote it. It's on Def Jam. Okay, Divine. There's one that's not an LL. Johnny oh. Nash. All right, so they're not. So he all did. D- yeah, he gathered other. Yeah. you know. But it's funny that he, you know, was able to leverage that on top of the song. You know, there are some. Needle I respect drops. it. There are some needle drops. He did the brick layer. Uh, he's he's done a. Oh, he did Skip Trace, uh, which is like an action thing. Uh, yeah, some episodes of Burn. He's done a bunch of the, the Covenant. That like which I think movie. Die Hard Two is why I knew his name. Yeah, yeah. And so 99, the year of the Matrix, the year of Fight Club, the year of American Beauty, American Pie, The Sixth Sense also brought us. Oh, yeah. Deep Blue Sea. Deepest Blue is Sharks Fin. Yeah, this was. (laughs) Saffron Burroughs was her name. I forgot the actress's name. She was like in that late 90s, early 2000s. She had a little heyday. Saffron Burroughs, the richest sounding name I've ever heard. I know. That is some old money right there. Your first name is a spice, your last name is. Is like a verb, like burrow, saffron burrow, and not just any spice, but like a spice that oh, like fancy you spice. use sparingly and and is costly. Yeah, no, she sounds like saffron burrows. Yeah, <laughs> I've also never seen this. Oh goodness, well hey, the the Hoff. I've not seen. Uh, I feel like they showed us like clips from it in, oh, in sure high I've school seen science moments of it, but but yeah. yeah, not not like the actual complete. Let's movie. not watch it so close to 2020. I feel like we just lived outbreak. So um, yeah, with with my impression of Rennie Harlan, this makes perfect sense that he would make this movie. That but was a fun reaction, though. I'm actually really glad. Uh, it's usually uh, there's a moment during a, a watch where I'm like, either I didn't need to see this, or I wish I'd seen this in the theater. Sure, this <laughs> I should be seen this need way. To see this. No, no, like <laughs> reacting to it was a better experience than any other way I could have seen it. This is, yeah. Do like you know a, what I mean? Like this was a party. Perfect reaction movie because it's like it, it's always moving at a, 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 an enjoyable pace. And for whatever reason, the blend of like, yeah, the, the script in terms of the characters is often like kind of wacky and like an action movie. And it's like everyone's making the water puns and stuff. But yeah, like the actual nuts and bolts of the movie, it's like it doesn't have to be this super deep rumination on anything if it doesn't want to be. As long as it's blue. As long as it's deep and it's blue and it's at the sea somewhere. And and yeah, it's like the action, you know, punches and the suspense is pretty good. And like the things this movie is here to do, it's good at doing. And the cast 
yeah, the cast, you know, showed up. So no matter how wacky some of the dialogue can be, like, I still bought everybody and I still liked the general crew. And I like that you didn't need too much nonsense or melodrama, really. And even initially when it was just LL on his own, I was like, oh, damn. Like, you know, thinking yeah, I was he bummed might... he was on his own separate movie and then he yeah. wouldn't get to And then they made it a and second way for And he joined the him. movie and it was like, it was great. It was, and he it was lived. beautiful. And, and yeah, and you have, you know, Sam Jackson, who always, even though this is earlier on, you know, he's still well established by now and brings a certain amount of weight uh, to a role like this. That monologue was so good. It was so good. And then for him to get, I like, I would have loved to be in a theater during that moment because that moment, I think, again, I would imagine that at the time this came out, you wouldn't have expected that because of the casting of Samuel Jackson, like, is a loaded thing. Again, he's, he's clearly, you know, of the Sam Jackson, you know, uh, status that we know, and it's only grown since then. So, yeah. it, so that effect only gets better if you don't know what's going to happen, because then it's like, well, it's Sam Jackson. He's, He's got to be make great. Yeah, yeah, it's the rich guy at the end that goes like, I shouldn't have done this. I sh- yeah, exactly. I thought he was going to be Richard Attenborough. I thought he was going to like close and, the park. And this had that really co- th- had that like old timey, almost like Hayes Code esque quality, where it's like, okay. Like, everyone involved with this in the most sort of morally dubious ways gets eaten or, or killed in some way, shape, or form. And it's like you expect that the main, uh, you know, uh, doctor lady who's on the poster is going to sur- survive till the end. And she almost does. But then, like, it almost feels like that moral periphery magic has to come back and be like, no, th- this is you, like, abusing these sharks and creating this situation and violating all kinds of, you know, human laws as well. So, like... Y- y- you don't get to, you know, triumph, yeah. which is funny to me because and there's no like canned romance between her and Thomas Jane. They didn't have to Jurassic World us yeah. into having them, you know, somehow it's come a around to a romance with intimacy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's like I, I bought the ensemble of them in the way you would like an alien. Mo- like it's just enough of that like alien movie thing where it's like, OK, you've got an ensemble in some remote lab. Yeah. And then it's Jaws and then it's Jurassic Park. Should we have done this? Is this, you know, a crime against nature? And it's like the B movie version of all that stuff. But like it's, yeah, well effective and it gets the right things, I think pretty right that's why asylum hasn't done this yet because it's close yeah like, it's like this is asylum's jurassic park yeah. it is jurassic shark it totally is i i had a lot of more fun than i expected i i hadn't known much i knew the theme song because it's <laughs> iconic I, I but uh not. that's all i knew and then when the cast kept popping up i kept thinking like oh this is a bigger movie than i thought it was yeah. i kept thinking this was a smaller film but the cast kept stacking and even though scars guard wasn't big at the time it's still LL was huge at the time. Uh, I think Saffron Burroughs is probably like the height of her powers. Thomas Jane was like right around the mist era. This was like the ascension of, of Thomas Jane. So this was like a yeah. stacked cast. Um, and I love SWAT and SWAT <laughs> has LL and Samuel Jackson in it. So that's uh-huh. also around this era. Um, so I was really, that's all I kind of knew was, was the song. So I knew LL was in it, but I, I, I had so much fun discovering the fun of it. And I think the best thing this movie does is it's one of the best ticking clock slash dynamite lit movies I've ever seen. Like yeah. the adventure is constantly level up, level up, level up. <laughs> the water is the villain. The sharks are the villain. Man versus self. There's so much going on, but the tension is palpable and it really makes you feel like you're in it. Like I got cold at points. I felt like I was like in yeah. the, the claustrophobia. So like the script is rough, but the story is good for what the movie is. Like the, the story allows you to keep ramping up that tension and then when they needed the good writing, they gave him a monologue. But like it was, uh, I, I had a blast. Like, and, I, and I'm glad to watch it this way. I think this format, like sharing it and yelling, was yeah. way more fun than like catching it on TV. Even yeah, it's Hollywood. It's like Hollywood pulp at its finest. Because yeah, like it, it. it I'm fascinated by movies like this. And it's funny that it's nothing like Silent Hill. The, the most recent time I watched that movie, I had this fascinating experience with it, where I was like, this is beautifully a midnight movie Mm. you know for reasons that could you know like there are things that could be better about this that make it kind of fun and cheesy but also like the other half of what it's doing it's actually like pretty good at doing (laughs) and is really effective at and so it's like it's one of those movies that has that meme like quality that has that sort of b-movie exploitation quality but without feeling like anybody like it's like even though the script is kind of wacky and the dialogue is kind of wacky, I don't feel like anybody just didn't care. You know, yeah. like I feel like 
you know, people had fun or at least like wanted to, you know, make something punchy and, and you know, easily consumable. Um, but yeah, it's like it had just the right amount of like turn in the screws. And, and yeah, it's like you get a guy like Rennie Harlan, who is a bit of a vet, who can, you know, take that and elevate, like you said, all those ticking clocks and all those proximal things of, of, of yeah, it's like this part's collapsing and there's fire above us and there's water down here. And it feels like you're watching some kind of classic disaster movie. Like it's it's a bunch of stuff all rolled into this, yeah, like, fun blockbuster monster movie package. And it's, like, it's one of those movies where, like, any of the flaws almost improve Enhance it. it. Yeah. It, it's really got its own, like, well, that made it better. This it is a movie really... full of bugs that are features. Yes, you know, yes, In a good way. In the best way. <laughs> Man, they did, in fact, die hard. Now that I know the director, that really does allow for that ticking clock to feel, like, yeah, that, that was so, that part is so impressive. Yeah. And, and all we edited needed was a naked workout scene. I mean, That's we were we so needed, close. You know? Right there, next time. That's in Deeper Blue or Seer. Yes. Uh, this was fun. We hope that you enjoyed our zeal, because I was way more cheery, loud, excited than I expected that. I had a lot of fun with that i'm now gonna crank that on the way home along with head sprung which i yes. love i love going back to cali but i'm a cali person and that song's actually about ll hating cali if you listen to lyrics oh. uh because it's i'm not going back to cali because he oh. doesn't like cali it was the west coast east coast beef so at the time he was not in the west coast side he was a new york guy there's a lot of history about that song but uh i do i do like head sprung because it is when ll has come back to hip-hop yeah. and i did like that he had that beautiful arc as an actor still acting but head sprung felt He's like he was like by man. the way i can do it both so that was the era of ll i like but uh rock the bells is one of eminem's favorite albums and eminem considers ll the greatest of all time so i want to end this video by saying <laughs> listen to some ll put some respect on his name he's mm -hmm. one of the goats that doesn't get appreciation i'd mm -hmm. say him and busta rhymes all you kids don't love to the scale you should a lot of people know the classics those are like right after the classics right before the modern they fell somewhere off the goat list and that's wrong Buster Rhymes and Ella Cool J are icons and they're uh, both in the Halloween franchise I've never seen the one with Busta oh it's fun <laughs> I will say this. <laughs> there are two, two very prominent appearances by notable rap artists in the Halloween franchise. And one, is highlights? A, one is a good performance and the other one is a highlight. <laughs> I mean, I, they're both highlights. <laughs> one of them is actually like a decent, solid oh. performance. And the other is one it is... Is Buster Rhymes? Because I'm worried it's not. <laughs> It's definitely Buster Rhymes. Great coin. rapper, Buster <laughs> Rhymes. Oh, I'm so excited for you to Excellent see that. Excellent rap Hall artist, Halloween Busta Resurrection Rhymes. is peak. Is it in Resurrection? It's in Resurrection. Who's in H2O? LL is in H2O. Okay. Because he's I like the security guard in theater, at the school. So I was like sad. And he's like an actual performance. It's right. good. Because it's <laughs> uh, Joe Scorn Levitt's in that one? Yay. Or Josh Hartnett. H2O I saw in theaters, so I was okay, like, yeah. I was way too young. Snuck into that Jiggle shit. Jiggle might be in it, but I know I know Hartnett is like Jamie Lee's kid oh, who's, who's in the boarding school. Which is like the faculty stuff. era Hartnett, yeah. which is a favorite Hartnett era of mine. And then well, Busta this is Rhymes, they just, they just put the camera on him and they were like, see, the thing is, to, to close us out, <laughs> to make the Deep Blue Sea review about Halloween rapper appearances. <laughs> yes, please. LL Cool J is like an actual character, and they're like, okay, well, cool, we're working with you. <laughs> Obviously, you have your appeal, but you're going to be the security guard and, and you're going to be a character. And then you watch Resurrection, and it's like, we, we got Buster Rhymes. <laughs> what do just we do with the Buster camera on him And just let him do his thing. Just let him do whatever he wants. And, and that's the budget right you there. You know who was good at Daredevil? Uh, have you seen the Coolio cut, the director's cut? Yes, he's Coolio's so, so good, good, good in that. that. Speaking of rappers that can actually act, oh, Coolio's good in Daredevil. Yes, justice Guys, for the Coolio the cut. The next Koi Comic Corner is actually <laughs> just going to be a ra rappers turned actors that are good. <laughs> yes. Dead Busta at the top Busta of the list. Busta Rhymes, <laughs> right up there. Busta Rhymes, you're a great rapper. Uh, well, that's going to do it for this episode of John and Coy discuss rap unexpectedly <laughs> at the end of Deep Blue Sea. Please let us know in the comments below who your favorite rapper turned actor is and who your favorite actor turned rapper is, because that's another conversation. Uh, also, I haven't seen Twister since VHS, and I, the new Twister's coming out Twisters. this year. Twister's. That'd be a fun rewatch. Oh, boy. Because uh, I haven't seen that. I, I think it would almost count as a first-time watch, because that was like 90 seven coister i would have been nine. Oh, um man. so yeah let us know below what you want us to watch uh this is always fun teaming up with john this one was a roller coaster ride oh yeah with sharks uh much love reject nation we'll see you soon shark 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 shark